Safeway climbing. Today we're here at the Blaisdell YMCA. We're going to be working with Aaliyah, who is part of our Beacons program. The Beacons program, they come swimming here uh, once a week, and we teach them how to be safe in the water, around the water, and even do some boat safety stuff with them. Take about maybe 10, one. We get kids from all different ethnicities coming in. The majority of those kids um, are like free reduced lunches, so a lot of the families don't have the opportunity to take swim lessons, so this is their chance to get in the water and really start knowing how to be safe. Aaliyah's been swimming with us for a good three years now, and she took to it really well. I had to stay in the shallow end for a little bit, and then once I got up to third grade, I went to the deep end. Okay, nice big breath and face down. One of our major goals that we try to teach them is how to float and holding their breath so if they end up in water over their heads, they know how to get to safety. Let's do it again. For Leo, what we did was we practiced swimming on our fronts, full length of the pool, swimming on our backs, and then the swim, float, swim. Yep. So you're gonna roll over to your back and take a small break and breathe. Sometimes if you're doing your front stroke, you shouldn't keep swimming because then you'll get really tired. You should just take a break and then you go for about five seconds and then you go back. We teach them they always have to have a buddy or most important to have an adult with them when they go swimming. I feel safe around the water because I know that if I was swimming by myself, I would try to stay near land and I wouldn't go too far out. These kids are my neighborhood. It makes me feel good knowing that I'm helping all these kids that wouldn't normally get an opportunity to swim learn how to be safe. You did a really good job today. I'm very proud of you. Keep I want my kids to be safe.